In this video, we will review how to create a lattice in Altair Inspire's new implicit modeling ribbon. To utilize the implicit modeling tools, users either need to import an existing geometry or create geometry. Geometry can be imported from native and neutral file formats, and single and multi-body assemblies can be imported. However, in our case, we're going to create our own geometry. Inspire has numerous modeling commands that enable users to create their own geometry. I'm going to model a bracket using the polyline feature, and then adjust the dimensions accordingly. Inspire's sketching tools, dimensions, and parametric relations means you can create various types of geometry very efficiently. After creating the sketch, I then make my 2D object a 3D object. I can do this through extrusions, sweeps, revolves, or other commands. For this geometry, I'll create an extrusion of 10 inches to make a 3D model of my bracket. With our solid model complete, we can now create our lattice. Inspire's implicit modeling ribbon has multiple options to create different lattices. Let's create a surface lattice on our part. After clicking on the surface lattice, I can select multiple types of unit lattices to apply. Inspire leverages GPU, so I can quickly change lattices and preview different shapes and sizes. I'm gonna select a gyroid double lattice. Multiple sizing options allow me to change lattice density diameters and spacing to meet manufacturing requirements. For this model, I'm going to apply a density and spacing to give me about 50% lattice. After applying the size requirements, it can also specify if I want the whole part to be lattice or just the interior to be lattice. Let's select the interior lattice option. Now that our lattice has been created, we can review it with Inspire's easy visualization tools. We can create custom cross sections to understand how the lattice looks across various planes and on interior parts. In my case, I can see the interior lattice and its spacing and everything looks great. Additionally, we can review all construction history in Inspire. If I wanted to go back and adjust the lattice, I can do it by clicking on the construction history and clicking on the lattice option in my tree and then editing the lattice option accordingly. Inspire's new implicit modeling capabilities give users the flexibility create complex lattices and shapes. To learn more about Inspire or other Altair products, go to www.trueinsight.io.